Hello everyone. In this video, we will discuss about Slack platform and how to use that. So, what is Slack? Slack is a communication platform or messaging platform which is used to create a community space or quickly we can create polls, video conference and we can also share documents and files with all our teammates. So how to create an account or a workspace in a Slack? So for that just click on the option sign up with Google and then select the account you want to register. That's it. We have created an account in a Slack. Either you can directly create a workspace or else we can join an existing workspace through mail invitation. So if you want to create a workspace then just click on the create workspace and fill the remaining details. Or if you are an existing member of a Slack and you want to know remaining features of the Slack then just we will look into on that. So here you can see the Devincept workspace. So first thing, how to change our name and display picture. For that, just click on your icon and then click on edit profile. And you can enter your full name and you can also enter the display name you want to keep and you can enter your phone number. And if you want to change the display picture, then click on upload an image and you can select the image which you want. So once you completed with all these things, then just click on the save changes. All the changes related to display picture and name are done. Next thing, how to create a channel in a workspace. For that, just scroll down below the channel section and then you can find an option called add channels. And then select create a new channel. Enter the channel name. And if you want, you can type the description of your channel. Inbuilt it will taken as a public channel. If you want to keep it as a private then just click on the private and then click on create and if you want to add the members in the channel you can directly type their mail id or enter their name So, and then click on the add so that person will be added in this and if you want to see the members who are present in this group then just click on here so you can see the whole members are there and if you want to do any changes you can just click on the settings and you can see the changes and if you want to delete the group then just click on the Archu channel then the whole group will be deleted next thing how to keep a text message in a group for a particular person or for a whole group if you want to keep a message for a whole group then you have to address with at the rate channel and now you can type the message you want to address it will notify every person who present in the group but you want to address only a single person in the group then just you can address him with at the rate And the next thing, how can we add the link to a text? For that, first type your message. If you want to add the link to a particular word called form, then just select that and click on the option called link and paste the link here. And then just click on the save option. Then just click on the save. So you can see that it the color of the text has been changed not only that if you want to see the whole shortcuts of the slack in the desktop version then just click on the thunder symbol and you can see the shortcuts and also there are many other features for the text department if you want to enter any bold text then just click on the bold option and enter your message if you want to italic then just click on the italic if you want to type a message in a new line then you have to enter this shortcut command shift plus enter both at a time and now we will see how to create a simple poll in a group first scroll down and you can find an option called simple poll click on that and now just click on create poll and select the channel you want to keep the poll
once the everything is done you can just click on preview option create poll it will keep a poll in our group so you can see that your poll has been created and if you want to delete your poll then just click on the options and you can directly select delete poll option so i hope everyone got understand how to use slack platform and i will also attach the documentation link in the description check out that thank you